Hello. I want to show you something today that is a combination of two of my previous videos working in tandem. And when you see this, maybe it'll spark a little bit of an idea in your mind for um, taking care of a need you might have. Um, I'm working on this cross, and right now the cross has real uh, straight edges on it. And I really want to work on this edge, but it's kind of hard to clamp it in a vertical position like this. I have to be a little bit of careful with it not snapping. So what I'm going to use is this device. And this is in one of my earlier videos. And you can see it looks like a large triangle that's cut at an angle. And it fits in like a puzzle piece right into a slot that's cut into the other piece with a base on it. So if I'm going to use this, take a look at how nice these two things, this along with these hold fast, work in tandem. Now to get a real nice tight hold, all I need to do since I have holes drilled into my workbench is I can set this where I want it. And now I've added a little bit of vinyl under here. Actually it's leather so I don't dent any wood that I'm trying to clamp down, but I'll put a hold fast on each side and smack it a few times. Now this is good and tight. It's not going anywhere. I can slide my triangle back and put my cross in a position that I want to work with. And when I get it right there, you can see I can tap it back here. And now, I, you know, this is in here good and tight. I can go and get my Dremel tool and I can run it up the side. And when I'm done with that, to change it if I'd like to, take my hammer, tap there, this comes out, and if I want to move this to a new location, a couple of taps, it's ready to go. I hope that gives you an idea. These are wonderful, and you can make them out of scrap wood. These here, I think I mentioned earlier, they're about 18 bucks each which is kind of expensive, but you'll find that they are invaluable at times. I hope you enjoyed this little film.